Suicide. It's the coward's way out, right? Every time someone kills themselves, they go, he took the coward's way out is all he did. Suicide is for cowards who don't want to deal with their problems, so they want an easy fix and an easy solution. Fuck you. <laughs> First of all, life, life is like animal porn. It's not for everybody. <laughs> it isn't. It's sad when kids kill themselves because kids didn't really give life a chance, but life is like a movie. If you've sat through more than half of it and it's sucked every second so far, chances are it's not going to get great right at the very end and make it all worthwhile. No one should blame you for walking out early. Every time someone kills himself, they, he took the cow. If it were a coward's way out, everyone would be doing it. Come on, how many brave people do you really know? There'd be no more root canals or IRS audits, AIDS test. No, I seen the chicks you fuck. Take the coward's way out on our man. You don't even want to know. I ask her to dance, man. Fuck you. You ask her to dance. Well, you're the one who keeps looking at her. If you're going to look at her, why don't you go over and ask her? Ah, well, fine. I will go ask her then, you dick. Hi. I was sitting over there, and I was wondering, you know, maybe on the next slow song or something, if you wanted to dance, or, unless that's your boyfriend. I'm sorry, I'm just not really good at this. Boom! Oh, he took the coward's way out. Clarence is a pussy. I knew he was going to chicken out and blow his head off. Dude, he's a pussy. He wouldn't even do a shot with us, fucking homo. Life is precious, too. To you, you're young. You're fucking few dollars in your pocket. Your shit going on. Sell that life is precious shit to the 90-year-old guy. Graveyard shift at the nursing home. He's moaning with dementia. Can't even recognize his own children anymore. Got big floppy hangy penis lips from 10 years of catheterization. Oh, life is precious. Yes, turn me. Oh, I savor every sunrise. Could you empty my bag? It's leaking on the blanket. The only reason he hasn't killed himself is he can't figure out a way to do it with pudding. <laughs> this is a nursing home story. This is a, a little over a year ago. was in Sarasota, Florida. They found an 87-year-old woman dead in her bed in a nursing home with 1,625 ant bites on her body. Ants. And someone had to count those. And I bitch about my job. <laughs> Ants. How do you explain that one to the grandkids, huh? No, no, honey. Nana's not with us anymore, sweetie pea. No. No, see... See, God decided that he loved Nana so much he wanted her right there in heaven with him. Yeah. So he sent an army of fire ants to tear through the drywall and then slowly chew her to death where she lay there defenseless and unable to scream. Good night. <laughs> Mommy, will God send fire ants for me someday? <laughs> Only if you're good. Only if you're good and you pray every day. Then Jesus sends the bugs for you. Good night. Who's got you in the belly? <laughs> oh